Okay, hi everyone. I am coloring, bleaching my hair, so I'm going blonde again. So, forgive me for my ugliness. I feel like Medusa or something. <laughs> but my hair at the top is bleaching, but the bottom isn't. The back isn't, so I gotta do it the third time. But I'm gonna color the back separately. Before it's just one shot, it will all, the whole entire head would be blonde the way I wanted but now I have to do it two three times I don't know what's going on with me I lost my touch <laughs> okay see look at those papayas up there I hope you can see all those papaya there's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten on this one and five on this one so they have still baby see they're still baby papayas and Two, two Van Tran is laughing at my food where he ain't got no food. He just have 10, but 10 so small. And then what about tomorrow? He's craving for papaya. The next day he's craving for papaya. The next day he's craving for papaya. But it's not even ready to eat. Look at that. So let's see how many he has on this one. Two, four, six, eight, ten. 10, but it's so small, so tiny. Look how, look how tiny his papaya is. See, <laughs> compared to the big one I have. And then let's look at this one. This is a small one. It's not even fruiting yet. So there's no papayas yet. But there's a little thing sticking out. But I don't know yet. If this is a transgender or a male or female papaya, so just when you thought you're making fun of me or laughing at me or laughing at my food papayas, but look at who's the one starving. You don't have papayas to eat, and I do. So right now, anyways, I gotta downsize and eliminate my clothes. I gotta throw away everything or donate it and travel light and I'm gonna walk out of this house very soon after I downsize and eliminate do whatever I need to do and walk out and abandon this family and never come back here again so after I uh, do my hair I'm just gonna travel light with my suitcase the rest, you know, I can camp out with it. Look at this. Let's say, for example, the size of this papaya. Okay, every time I peel off the skin, and then I cut it in half, and I can only split three people, but it's not even enough for one person to eat, and then imagine having to share and split with two more people. And they keep on depending on me eating off of me, where I don't even have enough for myself to eat comfortably. And keep on thinking I have to share my food with everybody. But this is not a place for everybody to eat, though. Not a place for, or a time for everybody to eat together, the whole entire nation. This is not every day. So, you know, it's like I always have to give up my meal for them to eat comfortably and they're gonna bully me, harass me, mock me, insult me, and um, start shit with me. Why do I have to share my food with them for? I eat by myself. I eat in private by myself. I don't eat with homeless people. That kind of homeless people. No class people like Hutton T. Lay and Tu Venture and, and Gina Kim. And Sunny and Miss Kim Kim. And from now on, Auntie Lei, if she wants to eat papayas or whatever, she, or avocado, she needs to buy home shit and eat, you know. I can't afford to share with her, give her free food, donate free food for her every day. And this goes for Gina Kim and Tu Van Tran too. And everyone involved. <laughs>